I know what you're probably going to say, and that will be, Daniel, where have you been for the uh, the last two weeks? Well, I'm going to take the opportunity to play catch up with you, as well as uh, just go over a few changes that you've probably noticed on this channel and just some of the things that I've got planned going forward into the new year. For starters, the last two weeks have been uh, pretty eventful to say the least. I uh, I was hired to go and do some filming up north, so uh, that kept me busy for a while. I was filming some workshops and events for a client, and um, when I came back to London uh, and I was doing all my editing, I've also had the uh, the drama of my uh, my laptop deciding to somewhat die on me. Um, which has uh, meant that I've had to do all my editing and, and whatnot on my older computer, which takes like three times as long uh, with doing stuff. So it's just meant though that because of my client's work being priority, I've just not been able to uh, to make and uh, produce videos for this channel. So my apologies if you know you hit a wall and you were like, "Oh, Daniel, my uh, my anxiety is getting the better of me now, and uh, I've got a date coming up, and I don't know what to do." My apologies that yeah, you uh, you've just had to sort of uh, rely on all of my other videos uh, to keep you busy in the meantime. But I am back now. I've got all of my time back, which is uh, is is great, really. I, I certainly I can't complain. Um, but it means now that I can spend time again on focusing on content for this channel and hopefully on a daily basis. Although that can also be dependent on as long as my laptop plays uh, ball as well. Um, otherwise, it's very difficult to try and edit videos and put them out uh, on a, uh, a daily basis. During that time, though, whilst I haven't been able to compress videos, um, you may have noticed, if not already, then uh, definitely just have a look now. But I've uh, rebranded my channel just a little bit. I, I wanted something that was just a little bit more quirky and gave me the opportunity to bring my humor in because date and anxiety is a highly searched term. So uh, it just meant that, you know, my channel really wasn't getting the traction that I was hoping for, even though like I know, you know, what I'm doing and I'm incredibly happy with like the views and subs that I've got. But um, yeah, I just felt that I needed something that just stood out a little bit more because there is just so many videos on YouTube of uh, keywords that have dating and anxiety in, not necessarily together, but just those two words in. Um, and uh, and it's just meant that it was just very difficult to, to get to the top of the searches. So during my time, I was like, oh, I, I, I want something that allows me to bring more of my personality into it. You know, and I was thinking about all the times that I was filming with the uh, the dating coaches and how people would always say like, oh, you're that that camera guy for the dating coaches and stuff. And I thought, oh, you know what would be great would be if I was like walking down the street. It'd have to be Oxford Street because, you know, that's where all the magic tends to happen, especially in the dating world. But I'd be walking down Oxford Street and I'd want someone to sort of say like, oh, hey, it's that dating anxiety guy, Daniel. And then, um, and then I literally, I had kind of like a light bulb moment. I thought, that's the name of the channel. That's what I want to call this. Um, and, uh, and it took me actually like changing the name of the channel to, to come to that realization. So in a way it was kind of a blessing in disguise, but you may have also noticed for about a week or so, the, uh, the channel had my name. Um, but now I've got, uh, that date in anxiety guy. This is what the uh, the channel will be going forward. So uh, don't you forget that name. And uh, as for the actual content that I want to be putting out on the channel, well, it's not going to change so much. It's going to be all of the same things. I want to be helping people with their anxiety, their confidence, their self-esteem, uh, their limiting beliefs and whatnot, especially all in the field of dating. But... What I want to do, though, is I want to also take the opportunity to be interviewing people. I want to be doing client transformations with people. So I want to be able to work with people one on one, whether it be online or in person in London. Um, and, uh, and I also want to be doing in fields, too. And I feel it's highly important, really, 
that guys um, see that sort of stuff. And, and I've always felt that way anyway. With every coach that I've done filming with, um, I have always felt like, you know, guys need to be able to see what's possible for them to be able to do themselves. You know, you need to kind of shatter that limiting belief of, you know, oh, you can't talk to strangers. And, and it's crazy even to think over like the tens of thousands of videos that I had made with coaches that, you know, there are still guys that believe, you know, that just things aren't possible. So I want to be able to create content. Um, you know, I firmly believe that it's important to kind of prove what you preach. Uh, but the likelihood is that none of that is going to happen until the new year. Um, I've kind of just avoided all of the, the protests and stuff in London. Um, and uh, as it's nearer to Christmas now, uh, London just gets, in, in my view, especially when it's come to the filming side of things, it just gets a bit too hectic. Um, it gets too crowded and it's very difficult then to to try and film people. People are right, on missions to go and buy their presents and stuff and then they just literally want to head home. And uh, although that might sound like an excuse, trust me when I say I'd rather be able to take the opportunity to film an actual conversation with someone rather than it just literally just being people like walking past the camera and you just can't see anything at all. So uh, if anything, so just be patient until the new year and, uh, and definitely when I can also find someone who can happily and easily film that that sort of content as well uh in fact if anything if if you're if maybe you're the one watching this um and uh you reckon you can film then do certainly get in contact with me via my email um but yeah once i can get someone to film um it will most likely be in the new year that i will be making you know the infields the interview videos the client transformations with people um and uh, and really you know show off some more unique content for this channel that I know again is just gonna um, help men with their uh, their confidence and, and just having better dating lives. If you uh, aren't subscribed already, uh, please do follow um, to stay up to date on the, uh, the future content that I'm gonna be putting out. Hopefully again, as long as my laptop does play ball, uh, I'm gonna be able to put out content on a regular basis. So like fingers crossed with that. Um, as for the actual content, it's not going to change. It's going to be all the same sort of stuff. But now that I've rebranded, I'm going to be able to bring in a bit more of my own uh, personality and sense of humor in. Um, I think even over the years with the anxiety that I've experienced for myself, um, I've always found like comedy or just, you know, making people laugh or, or just making myself laugh is always something that has certainly helped me with um, with overcoming some of my issues. So uh, if anything, like the uh, the video, um, subscribe to the channel and, uh, and I'd love to hear maybe ideas of videos that you would love to see. Again, I know that Infields is um, pretty much at the top of the list, but yeah, if there are anything, any ideas or maybe you even want to collaborate yourself, then, uh, then yeah, do reach out. Um, other than that, um, I am that dating anxiety guy. Um, and, uh, and I hope you can appreciate the, uh, the new branding as well and, uh, and look forward to, uh, to more content coming from me in the, uh, future.